Hello, and welcome to my Resident Evil 5 Let's Play Part 1. Uh, sorry for not including the first opening cutscene, it's kind of messed up. I'm playing the uh, PC version, and for some reason my intro videos aren't working, but all the other cutscenes work, so it's alright. Um, I've played this game before. A bunch of times actually, both on the Xbox and on the PC. Um, I actually have another save with more stuff unlocked. But, um, I'm starting fresh on this one for you guys. Um, if you, if you want to see a playthrough with, you know, infinite ammo and stuff, I mean, let me know. But I figured it'd be more entertaining to start fresh. Um,. Also, I, w I decided to do a Let's Play in Resident Evil 5 because I have a friend that's doing a Resident Evil 4 walkthrough and because uh, it's his favorite Resident Evil and this, this is my favorite Resident Evil so I decided to go ahead and do this one. If you, if you guys want to see his uh, Let's Plays, well he calls them walkthroughs but either one, uh, if you guys want to see it, uh, his name... His name on YouTube is FoxDive555. I'll link them in the description if you guys want to see it. They're, I mean, they're not the best, but they're not bad either. You should, I mean, he's my friend. You know, might as well give him a shout out. They're entertaining if you like watching game walkthroughs. Good, you're both here. Come. This is all the boring stuff. Uh, I mean, I don't. If you guys want me to shut up during the cutscenes and stuff, I mean, let me know in the comments, but this this isn't really the important part. The, as the story goes on, I mean, I guess I probably won't be talking during the cutscenes. Alright, let's see what goodies we have in here. Got uh pistol and you got that body armor sitting there and I've always wanted to grab it but uh, I won't let you. And I got a skin going on for Shovel right now because I'm playing on the PC and Destination coordinates. I like it. Go through there. Alpha team's waiting at the deal location. Good. What do you know about Uroboro? So yeah, just so you guys know, um, like I said a million times already, this is on the PC. I am playing with an Xbox controller, just because I like it better over the mouse and keyboard f for this game in particular. Um, playing max settings, DirectX 10, all of the above. Uh, these videos should be in 720p when I upload them. So I'm bringing uh, top-notch quality videos for you guys here. See what we got in here. Oh, whoops! Excuse me for a second. I forgot. This is a different uh, profile that I'm on. And I forgot to change the settings to how I like them. It's like I said, I have another um, profile that I have all the stuff unlocked and everything on, but this is my commentary one. Yeah, but you can't show her. Oh, it doesn't look too pleasant. Um, I'll try and hit all the BSA symbols too for you guys. If I mean, it's it's been a while. I don't remember all the exact spots and stuff. I may miss a few, but I'll, I'll hit all the ones that I remember as I'm going through. Uh, where do we go here? Did you hear that? No, I didn't hear the screeching roar of death from in this building, Sheva. <sighs> Game's definitely better in co-op, but... 
I don't have any other friends that have this on the PC. They all have it on Xbox. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure he's just fine after he just had some throbbing organism shoved down his throat. Come on, Chris, get your head in the game. Yeah, now he has blood running from his eyes. You still think he's alright? Come at me, bro. Oh, getting the knife. Yeah. Trust the old knife. Only works on like the first two enemies, and you can't do crap with it for the rest of the game. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't have enough unlocks or anything right now, but if you sit here, you can actually kill all these guys. They they do stop coming at one point, and then when you kill the last guy, they drop one of the treasures. So if you're going for that achievement where you need to get all the treasures, that's one of them that you need to get. Contingency plans for this situation, do we, Kirk? Roger on the locals, but your orders still stand. What does that mean? Was HQ expecting this? Come on! You can't be serious. <laughs> until I get all the better stuff. It's so it, it's so weird not having anything after you're used to just r running through and blasting everybody with an infinite ammo hand cannon all the time. Uh, Alright, Chevy, you can have one of these. I'll spare you some mercy. Take it. Roger. I hate giving the bots stuff because they always end up wasting it. That can't possibly be good. <laughs> and roasted. I give credit to Christian Shovel for 
going through all this, man. I, I swear, like, I don't know what I would do if I saw anyone. I don't care if he was big and huge like that guy wearing a hood, whatever. It could be, like, the weakest, weakest guy in the world. If he was holding that huge axe, I'd probably crap myself, like, three times right then and there. Alright, we gotta do this old-fashioned style. I can't run through and mutilate everything like I normally would with all the unlocks and to actually hold out somewhat. Oh, look. Thanks for hunting a hand grenade of mine. Whatever this is. Grapefruits. I'm sure that's safe. Alright, you can have these shovel. Yeah, knife it up. Enjoy it while it lasts. Oh crap, I don't know where they're coming from. Boom. My god, Chris with his fist of fury just popping down with his hands straight to her face. Kurt, come in. The locals are hostile. The gate is sealed and we're trapped. We need backup and we need it right now. Roger that. Just stick tight. I'm on my way. You hear that, Sheva? Help's on the way. Got it. Just oh crap. Quick. And that means get out of here. And this is where you run for your freaking life after. Oh crap. Come on, Shava. Oh crap. And now you just book it. Set up a little, uh, thing here. Grab the scorpion over here, whatever it's called, I forget. Some kind of, uh, SMG. And grab some stuff around here, but I usually just go up where I'm, I'll show you. While my saying, you guys can see this. I need to tell you what I what I usually do if I'm just gonna do it anyways. Oh crap. I go up here. And I just kinda bait them around these couple areas where you have to jump. Come on, Shadow, you gotta tell me what's going on. You're getting attacked, say so. Come on, Kirk. I know you can be faster than that. You're in a freaking helicopter, for God's sakes. Get out of here. Um, another jewel you can get is if you end up killing this guy, which you... Most of these treasures, uh... You'd have to get on a second playthrough because you just don't have the supplies to do it on the first one. But, uh, if you end up killing him, you get, like, a... Bangle or something, I forget. And it's one of the, But it's one of the things you need to collect. 
I'm pretty sure there are other enemies that drop it too. But uh, you know, if you kill any one of those guys, the uh, executioners, then uh, you can get it from them. Oh shoot! On Kirk. There we go. Run, 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 run. Oh crap. That's all I want to do. There we go. Curbstone. Another curbstone. Chris handing out pain everywhere he goes. Oh crap. Come on, Shadow, quit getting beat up. Alright, well, that's the end of chapter 1-1, one, one. so I'm gonna end of part 1 here, and I'll see you guys in part 2.